Hey, John Turner with Seed Pride here, and in this video we'll go over the background settings. So you can easily customize the backgrounds using these settings. So you can select a color here, and you just choose whatever you'd like. And then um, by default, these settings are set to be responsive, but if you want to change these, go ahead and do it. Um, and then you can also select a background image here. So you just click the upload button, and you can go to wherever you have your background image. So I'm going to select one here real quick. <clears throat> okay, so let's just get this one. And we'll upload it. And then you'll just insert it here after it's been uploaded. So we'll select it. And now we have a background image. And we also have the ability to do slideshows and videos. Let's go ahead and save our changes here and you can kind of see where we're at at this point. So we'll preview it. And as you can see, a background image has been added to the page. Okay, so background slideshow, uh, to enable that just toggle the on off switch and you have a few uh, configuration settings here. You can randomize it, set the um, transition speed here and the effect that it has and then to add uh, images you just click here and you go ahead and select your uploaded images and then you can add more slides I'll just select these are the same ones so and then that's all there is to it and then save it and then you'll have a background slideshow and your third option is to add background video so let's go ahead and do that real quick and I am going to delete these slides okay and then let's toggle the background video and then here you'll just enter the URL that you have so you can enter a YouTube video, Vimeo, or MP4 URL so uh, just paste that in here and you can enable or disable the video and enable or, or disable looping and that's all there is to the background settings